Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Rachi Goyal and in this video we are going to solve x cube plus y cube divided by x plus y is equals to 7. And the second is x cube minus y cube divided by x minus y is equals to 19. Here we have to find the value of x and y and x and y belongs to positive integer. So let's start with the today's video solution. So first I'm using this equation. And I'm taking this x plus y to other side by multiplying both sides by x plus y. So we can eliminate this and we can write the equation as x cube plus y cube is equals to 7 multiply x plus y. Here we can use the very famous identity that is a cube plus b cube is equals to a plus b, a square plus b square minus a b. So the value of x cube plus y cube is 7, x plus y is equals to x plus y, x square plus y square minus x y. Now I'm going to divide both sides by x plus y. So we can eliminate this. So the value of x square plus y square minus x y is 7. I am considering it as equation number 1. Now it comes to this equation. So we can write it as x cube minus y cube. If I multiply both sides by x minus y. So we can eliminate this. So x cube minus y cube is equals to 19 times x minus y. So here again, we can use a very famous identity that is a cube minus b cube, a minus b, a square plus b square plus a b. So here the value of a minus b whole cube is 19. x minus y is equals to x minus y, x square plus y square plus x y. Now I'm going to divide both sides by x minus y. So we can eliminate this. So the value of x square plus y square plus x y is equals to 19. I'm considering it as equation number 2. Now I'm going to subtract 2 from first. So x square plus y square minus x y minus x square plus y square plus x y is equals to 19 minus 7. So x square plus y square minus x y minus x square minus y square minus x y is equals to 19 minus 7 is 12. Sorry, here is plus x y. So we can eliminate this. X square with x minus x square, y square with minus x y square. So x square, x y plus x y is two x y is equals to twelve, and x y is equals to six. Now, according to equation first, here I'm using equation first, so we can write x square plus y square minus xy is equals to 7. So x square plus y square, the value of x, y is 6, minus 6 is equals to 7. Now I'm going to add 6 to both sides. So x square plus y square is equals to 13. So as we know the formula of x plus y whole square, that is x square plus y square plus 2xy, so here we can put the value of x square plus y square is 13 and the value of 2xy is 12. 
So x plus y whole square is equals to 25 and 25 is the square of 5. So the value of x plus y is 5. Similarly, now I'm going to use equation second. So x square plus y square plus xy is equals to 19. So here we can use the formula of x plus y whole square, x square plus y square plus 2xy. So the value of x square plus y square is 13 and 2xy is Here I'm going to use the formula of negative. So the value of 2xy is 12. So 13 minus 12 is 1. So x minus y whole square. So the value of x minus y is under root 1. So value of x minus y is plus minus 1. So as we know that x and y belongs to positive integer. So we reject the negative value. So x minus y is 1. Now I'm considering it as equation number third and this as equation number fourth. Now I'm going to add third and fourth. So x plus y plus x minus y is equals to five plus one. So we can reject this y. So two x is equals to six. Now I'm going to divide both sides by two. So x is equals to three. Now we can put the value of x in equation number four. So x minus y is equals to 1. So 3 minus y is equals to 1. So 3 minus 1 is equals to y. So the value of y is 2. So the final values of x and y, x is equals to 3 and y is equals to 2. I hope it's clear and you find it useful. So please give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned.